What's going on Wix Nation, MPS here from Wix Training Academy and today I'll be showing you how to build a membership website in Wix. A complete guide on taking you through the process of building a membership website here on Wix. If you guys are brand new to the channel, thank you so much for watching. If you haven't already, make sure you smash that subscribe button and turn those bell notifications on. You'll instantly plug into the largest Wix training community on the internet. And by the way, today's video is brought to you by none other than Wix.com. Guys, if you haven't already checked out Wix.com, you can either go to the link here on the screen or click the link in the description below and embrace the power of this platform. Wix.com allows you to work seamlessly, it allows you to work efficiently, and it allows you to work effectively. So I encourage you, if you haven't already, to head out to Wix.com, again, link on the screen or in the description below, to make sure to go get started today because you're not going to want to miss out on what Wix is capable of, and it will help deliver your results to your business. Without further ado, let's hop into today's video. Okay, so we're here. I'm going to take you through the process. Uh, we're going to be using traditional Wix editor for this video. Uh, I'm going to start from a blank template just to show you from scratch how this works. Now, I'm going to preface this video again like I've been prefacing all of my videos. I am not a designer. I am not teaching you how to design in this video. I am teaching you how to build a membership website, which means I'm going to be teaching you the architecture. How do you build out the functionality to actually enable a membership website here on Wix. So Wix has actually evolved to create some pretty powerful membership tools here on their platform now and you really have complete customization and there's a lot of directions I could go with this video because there's a lot of different style membership websites you can build theoretically here on Wix. But I'm going to take you down the traditional path of at least adding members and adding some community based functionality so that way you can create a membership style website and or you can offer your members exclusive of content and it's really going to be exciting because like I said Wix has really amped up their game on what you're able to do with members so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to blank template and I'm gonna start from scratch while our templates loading up why don't we go ahead and hit that like button for Wix sponsored content and also membership content because it's more viable now than ever with everything going on uh, it only continues to grow in popularity and I'm sure you're watching this video because you're ready to implement your membership website as well. So throughout today's video, I'm going to show you all of the membership features that Wix has to offer. Although what you should know is you can and should customize your entire website prior to just all of the membership style content here on your site to meet the standards of what you're looking to build. Remember, I'm showing you solely the membership end of building this website. Although here's the good news. Very soon I'll be publishing a full tutorial on how to build a website as a whole in Wix. But for today, we're going to focus on solely the membership features and aspects of a website. And then we'll come back to in our next tutorial, building a website as a whole, because obviously you still need a website that showcases everything else outside of solely your membership functionality. So that's what we'll be touching on. Okay guys, so like I mentioned, we're now in the editor and I could go a bunch of different directions with this video. But what it all starts with is making sure you add the traditional basic members functionality. So what you're gonna need to do to do that is you're gonna have to go over here to add and you're gonna scroll down to members. Now this add a members area to your site is the basic backbone to adding membership to your website, okay? So this is where people can go to their account, you can add member pages, uh, it'll add a uh, sign up login bar at the top. It's the basic backbone of membership here on Wix. So you'll click add to site, and why don't you guys comment let me know, are you liking these Wix sponsored videos? What other videos would you like to see? Comments really help the video, they help the channel, so it'd be much appreciated. Even just say hello down in the comments, it's appreciated. Okay, so we've got 
uh, the Wix members area added now. And you can see it adds your basic backbone fundamental items. Up here, you've got a login bar. With your login bar, you can actually set up your login bar and you can choose what is shown on this bar. Is it the profile pic and the member's name? Is it just the profile pic? Is it just the member's name? You can choose the customization there. I'll go with profile pic and member's name. Now, what does it say before you log in? Uh, it can be login, sign in, whatever. You can change this text. Same with log out. Log out, sign out, whatever you'd like it to be. You can even show a little greeting before their name like hello or howdy or uh, hey, uh, whatever you'd like that to be. You can customize that as well. You don't have to have that either. Um, but then you're going to see member sign up settings. I've touched on this in several, several videos, but who can be a member? So when someone goes to actually sign up for a membership on your account, if you choose everyone, that means people will automatically be approved and they become a member instantly. However, if you choose people I approve, that means when someone signs up, you manually have to go in and approve members based off of criteria. So for instance, this would probably be more applicable if you've got an exclusive community or you've got like a community outside of just the website and you want to make sure that people from outside that are registering are actually part of that community. So you want to be able to hand approve them, uh, something like that, or it's like a cash payment outside of the community. So you need to make sure they actually paid, et cetera, et cetera. These would be examples of people you would approve. Um, now, as far as which option shows first, you can choose new member sign up, which prompts them to register first or existing member login, which would actually prompt them to log in first. Uh, you can choose that. A social and community, this enables Google and Facebook login and then just your policies up here and then you would just press done whenever you've got that set up so that's your login bar right then you'll see what is also added is this my account page so if we actually go over here to our menus and pages we'll see that member pages were actually added so you can add a members page and I'm just gonna do it to show you but if you add a members page one it'll prompt you on the type of page do you want it to be a personal profile page and I will go ahead and add this or you can add custom pages a public page or a private page a private page would be where they would keep their personal secure info public page would be where the community could interact and members can interact on that page so if you go here and you add profile and we add page what's gonna happen is Wix is gonna add this page but it's not gonna be added to our traditional page menu right it's gonna be added internally to your member page. So you can see it is now added here on the member page. So what the profile page does, and this is just a default page from Wix, is it actually allows your um, member to create a profile, write an about, add pictures, add GIFs, uh, videos, dividers, emojis, all that good stuff. So that way if people from maybe your forum that you've added want to come visit that person's profile they can see a little bit more about them their profile picture you can edit your profile picture uh, and change your uh, background you can assign badges to a particular person so it, it's really a comprehensive um, profile page right so, so you've got a profile page now granted it is limiting because these are the only aspects of uh, this particular profile page that you can add you can build custom ones and I've got several videos of that on my channel But for right now, this is much much better than Wix has ever had before they've really stepped up their game on this So now you can add um, Profile and you could customize your profile there. So these are your member pages What I just want you to remember is by going to the page manager your member pages are internal and they'll stay solely right here on this menu this is your like member page menu uh, so they separate out it's different from your just regular site menu which is really nice because now you can create internal navigation makes it easier for your members to get started now when it comes to membership here on Wix this is the other direction I'm gonna go so this this is your backbone right this is your backbone fundamental member style website okay uh, this adds your login it adds the profile but you're typically gonna go one of two ways with membership one you might go with the community style uh, which you're gonna add Wix forum and I'll show you here in a second or two maybe you member signs up and they get access to exclusive content so here's what I could tell you if that's the case so if they get ex uh, access to exclusive content maybe um, your members get access to content that you post you can go back to menus and pages you can add another member page here 
and you can add uh, a private page. And now what you can do is this, this page is your oyster. Uh, I mean, it's a blank canvas. You could come in here and you can start adding content. So for instance, if you wanted to create a database, add content to that database and then add repeaters on the page here. So that way all of your content is filtered right here. You can do that and you would just obviously activate your dev mode, turn on your dev mode. And I've got tutorials on explaining how to go add content. But for instance, maybe you just want to add, um, an image on this page. Now I, I'm just pulling random ideas here, but maybe let's just say one of the pieces of content they get for being a member is they get access to your portfolio of images, right? I'm just using an example. That might not be the case, but let's just say we've got this uh, businesswoman with a mask working. Okay. So you can add content on this page. So essentially what would happen is every single time they would go to this page on their member profile, they would get access to the content you have here. And again, there's a million different directions you can go here. You can add videos via repeaters. Uh, and show video content, you could show PDF content, you could show images, you can show written content. There's so many different angles you can take by adding content to the page. And that's one way to do it, is to have a member page where they can access your content. The other way to do it is what I mentioned, which is by going to add apps, typing in forum, and you can actually add Wix forum and it'll add it to your site. And what this is going to do is this is going to add a forum to your site. But what it ultimately does, I'll show you here in a minute. We'll let it add. Let's get a thumbs up down below if you're enjoying the content. Uh, pretty laid back style today. That's okay. So by adding a forum, now you've got an opportunity to create community among your membership website. So now people could come in here, they can post, you can uh, adjust your forum settings by going to settings, you can manage your posts, I'll show you that in a second, you can add categories, you can remove categories, you could change your settings, you can add a forum topic, you could choose the sorting of the forum. I actually created a video on how to create an online community in Wix, uh, another Wix sponsored content last time and I'll throw that in the cards above and that explains how to actually go through your forum here and customize it but what I want to show you is now if we go back to our member pages you can see a whole slew of pages were now added so if we go to my account now what has happened is since you added the forum it connects with the Wix members app so it talks to one another so now b via your Wix members app it also allows you to, well, we haven't had any forum posts or anything like that, which is why you couldn't see it. But I'll go back here and you can track your followers. So the, so the people that are currently following your profile, uh, you can track the forum comments, all of the comments that you've made and other people have made, all of the forum posts that you've created. Um, you've got notifications. So whenever someone follows you and you could customize notification settings, but whenever someone follows you, whenever you get a reply to a comment, whenever you get replied to a post, you'll get that information. And then you've also got settings and this is where you're able to manage the notifications you receive and choose what that looks like. Are you getting email notifications? How many, et cetera, et cetera. So you've got a whole slew of new membership functionality that you've added just by adding the forum here and it creates a cohesive community, right? So adding a membership and building a membership website in Wix is that it's just so intuitive and user friendly. Now what you do with the membership website is completely and totally up to you. The style you take is custom to you. If you want to add a forum and add community, if you want to add custom content and show your uh, members custom content, that's up to you. And that's the beautiful thing about Wix. Look, within five minutes, I just added a complete membership functionality style website. And it's beautiful, it's seamless, it's quick. You could customize every aspect to it. You could take different directions, different routes. If you guys enjoyed this video, I know it was quick, I know it was to the point, and I know it was a little bit more laid back, but I'd like, kindly ask that you drop a like down below. Comment, let me know if you enjoyed this content. What other content would you like to see? I, I'm open right now to content ideas. I'd like to hear from you. So please comment down below and let me know what you'd like to see. And I'm gonna add it to the queue to make. And lastly, 
Don't forget to smash that subscribe button, turn those bell notifications on, you'll instantly join the largest Wix training community here on the internet. And today's video is sponsored by Wix.com. Again, that link is in the description. You don't want to miss out on the power that Wix offers you, so make sure you go check them out. And I really appreciate you guys watching today's video. I'll catch you on our next one.